Good morning. And I'm out walking this morning. A little bit of a different scenery. Not the palm trees, <laughs> the sea. But an area nestled near Lake Huron called Georgian Bay, which is where our farm is. And when I'm out walking, I love to find these secret worlds. I find them so interesting. Earlier during my walk, I did uh, happen, uh, happen on some deer, but they scooted off in a hurry. But my goal would be to be able to walk and not disturb them. And it starts with just recognizing these special areas that are around us. And as we recognize these special areas, we can become quieter and quieter but still very present and be accepted by all the other beings and animals that are here. I imagine this is a pretty busy place at times. Lots of lots of animals visit this place. So if you're out walking today, find those hidden away special places, even if it's just a really small place. It could be it could just be as simple as stopping at a flower pot and really look at it and see what else is growing there besides the flowers you planted or tomatoes or cucumbers or bougainvillea depending on where you are when you're watching this and just imagine all the activity that takes place just beyond our awareness The animals we're familiar with and can see, and maybe some of the beings we don't see, like the elementals. There's a very thorny tree over here oh, that is full of personality. Just imagine all the winter storms that has seen. quite thorny so I imagine it's a hawthorn. And this is the path that led me to this hidden place. You can also stop and really notice the colors, the shadows, the shapes and designs of all the leaves. The wind is saying hello. When we allow ourselves to do this, it really feeds all of us. It feeds our physical body, and there's science behind that. It feeds our mental and emotional parts of us, and it feeds those parts beyond. 
Because after all, we live in this world too, and we are an extension of nature itself. These cocktails share the similar proteins and minerals and even DNA as we do. It feeds our sight, feeds our hearing, feeds our sense of smell, feeds our touch. And I did pass some wild blackberries, so it even feeds our taste. So, get out there and do some exploring, do some watching, do some observing. Even if it is a place that's familiar, when you look at it this way, it will feel like you're seeing it for the very first time. And I would love to hear about what you discovered. So please add your comments here or message me. And enjoy your day.